Hello everyone and welcome to our banter blitz one, well, oh, bullet, blue, bullet blitz one for September. All right, I started the day actually feeling crazily sick. I woke up like at 1 or 1.30 after like four days of really insane sleeping, including flights, no sleeping in flights, and then oh, no sleeping for whatever reason. So, well, I woke up at 1, which is extremely rare. Okay, I went to sleep at 3, 4, so... Now it is, it's 10, I'm in Israel, so, all right, I will hopefully have some energy. I, I felt really sick, but I'm not. The Olympiad is totally crazy, and other than that, I don't know what else is interesting. I'm not even going to the most interesting part, which is Hillary versus Donald, but that is something else. Okay, so we will just try to do some chess, and, well, maybe a little other than chess. All right, when Sando is going to start, Sando just started it. Okay. Oh, and I forgot that I'm playing a minute plus a second per move, so that means I should, well, try to talk less than usual, which is never easy, right? Never easy. It's like the the speaking about talking, like the best the best uh, chess analysis ever. Can you imagine Giri versus Svidler? Okay, my opponent knows very well what he's doing here. This I know. He's playing all the right moves there, mister. Okay. He's playing too good. No joke. Okay. This this variation is... Okay, it's a very, very... You can call it chicken-wise play, but maybe not a really bad one. Okay. I don't know if I really want to take, but, well, I just did. Well, hopefully I'm a somewhat better here, but... Okay, here, here. I think I will <clears throat> try to stick something to to uh, E4 at some point. Okay, right now H2 is under attack, but... Yeah, this move... This move, okay, let me go here. I mean, okay, I see some some dangerous story to this position. It's maybe not so clear, but... Okay, I cannot speak too much because it's my opponent turn to think. And as it is, I'm... I don't know. This position is not so clear. Okay, I don't know. I'm going to play this chicken move. Don't ask me why I didn't play rook fe1. Stupid. So I already answered to you. You got my yeah. You got my stupid comment. Yeah, Rook F E one was thousand times stronger. That was a ridiculous move. If I prevent him from exchanging, oh well. Next move, I'm gonna play King back to G one. Don't worry. Oh, my opponent plays really well. I mean, he played the opening first. Okay, forty seconds. I just need to remember that I have a minute. Okay, that's most important thing to remember. That I have a minute. Okay. Yeah, I would say I, I think I'm very minimal better here. I like my position at some... Somewhat before, I like my position more. But that was before. Okay. Well, my opponent thinking that is always welcome. So what do do I want to exchange knights? Do I not want to exchange knights? I really don't know. Okay, this move is a bad move for him. I think so because I think that I'm just getting a huge amount of play on the on the squares. Actually, now I think I'm winning or kind of winning. Yeah, that that was very very no move. I mean, e5. The entire idea was that the pawn on e6 was protecting quite a lot of squares there. E F5, D5. After E5, I got the D5 square, I got the F5 square, no doubt. So that was a really not, you know, Mr. Secret System. You played really well pushing the E pawn if you're going to follow after it see some of, uh, you know, the, the live stream. Moving the E pawn was purely wrong. But okay, it was a decent game. All right, next one. 
You see, usually I'm complaining. Tired. Indiana Fats against Indiana Jones. Oh, my goodness. Indiana Fats. Do, 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 do. All right. All right. Okay, I'll play this E6 system. Everything okay, right? But I somehow like like to play the most with Knight G on E7 and... Okay, there are many systems that are okay for white, for black, everyone's happy. Yeah, this one. Honestly, I used to play such junk with white and I don't know, I kind of came to prefer black in those positions, no joke. Just kind of came to prefer black in those positions. Yeah, I actually had a, I had exactly such a game, exactly such a game here on the banter blitz, like two or three months ago. After my opponent will play his move, I will tell you what my opponent. My opponent then played this move, and I played knight d4, and it was seriously, you people, this is exactly how a game I played on banter chess. I don't know, some time ago went. Exactly. Two, I, I would say two months ago. I would say the July one. Exactly this way. So, should I give you red ticket for not going over your games, for not analyzing it? Because it's exactly like this. Okay. Yeah, this move is blundering the bishop. In the other way, he played rook d1. I think I took on c4 and... Somehow I won the game. Okay, you know what? I was going to move my... Oh, but Sandro, you actually gave, made it... Uh, or my opponent made it 3-2. Okay, I didn't. I haven't paid attention, but... All right, I think anyhow, this game is pretty over, and... It's your job, my job, to... Little bit look more that the games are 3-1. Just my tea with... I don't know. I'm drinking tea as a disguise... To actually get to drink honey. You know, I'm just so crazy about honey, so I'm just getting some tea and shoving, like, I don't know, endless amount of honey there and pretending it's healthy. By the way, I do the same thing with, with um, I don't know, granola, that I pretend it's, I pretend it's healthy and all these things, but I just do it for... I don't know, many, many other reasons. And I don't know how to protect the pawn, which is super duper now annoying me, actually. I'll be honest with you. Okay, I'm going to go here. That was annoying. I cannot protect this pawn. Okay, but now I go here. Yeah, or, or I eat salad, just so I can take all the things next to the salad. The olive, the cheese, the, you know. So I, I pretend to eat it like that, but... No, the healthy stuff is not tasty, but makes you feel good when you eat it with other things. And this game, go to... Okay, if someone has energy, one of the previous banter chests, I would say either July or June, probably July. All right, now we will see that it's 1-1, one, one, and we will start our play. Alrighty. Oh, yeah, beautiful. Starting with a minute. Jobava system. What is Jobava system? Jobava has many bizarre chess systems. So, uh, one of the most interesting creative players out there. Allowing d5 here, I don't think it's great for black, whether you're Jobava or not. I think this is just something for white. I think why just a bit better here? Well, now it's a bit more than a bit, right? No, mister. No, 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 no. Yeah. Okay. Uh, how to play? Okay, I'll take bishop g5. Uh, it looks reasonable. Yeah, okay, I take... Bishop c4, and I castle next move, don't care about anything. Even if black... If black had an extra piece, I think white has compensation because of the d5 square, but I didn't even look if I can take on d7 or not. Okay, I think I can, so let's grab that pawn off the board. Although I really shouldn't, you know, it's it gives black the 
tiniest chances, but oh wait, that was Jobava wouldn't have been proud of this game and allowing d5 to block the Fianchetto bishop is a big no-no in this system. Oh wait, secret pyramid, my goodness, it's all about secrets, you know, what before it was secret system, secret pyramid. Oh my god, speaking about ridiculous, horrible movies, I'm a huge X-Men fan. Huge, crazy. I used to watch the cartoons 20 years ago when they had X-Men. And man, I, I watched X-Men Apocalypse just recently. Oh my goodness. That's such a bad movie. I mean, like, oh my gosh. Mercy, mercy. Oh. That was such a bad movie. So, reminds me of the pyramid. First thing I was thinking was that ridiculous movie and why have I ever watched it? Well, just had to put it behind me. All right. Well, speaking about X-Men, I was watching really quickly, like half sleeping, the past that was something like that. Man, that was too complicated without paying any attention. So that's something we need to look at. Now, this position, what can I say? My opponent is playing incredibly solid. And I don't know, equal, maybe even tiny, tiny bit better for white. Ah, let's call it equal, but all right. This is, this is equal game. What can I do? Okay, now maybe I will pretend to get, to give him an isolated pawn, you know? Maybe. Okay. Yeah. No, I here. Give me the C file. No, okay. I mean, here I, I'm happier than a few moves ago. I mean, he should have taken on C5 and white has 3 versus 2. No, okay. Not much, but better to be... Better to be white in that no match, I think. Now, I just need to be careful not to play like a move like queen before, which I'm very tempted to play because of knight takes f7. So, this I'm allowing myself my I'm allowing myself to say because I'm not gonna play that and it will be the most embarrassing thing in the history of the world if I will actually play Queen before and allow him Knight take b7 so all right I will claim that I'm tiny bit better tiny bit and we can play okay here here, I guess. Well, maybe I'm not better, you know. I thought maybe, but... I would prefer to play this position with my pawn on b7. But I guess you can't have it all. Okay. Okay, my opponent is taking half a minute per move or more. He's very welcome, but that's a bit too much. You know, if, even if, if White knows nothing what to play, okay, play G3, play something. I mean, I just think it's way too much. Why didn't I Queen here take there? Not so clear. Okay, can I go for it? Somehow it looks so tempting, but... No, wait, I really don't know what to play, so I'm going to... Okay, this I know what to play. Oh, man, I thought I'm winning here. Man, I'm such a putzer, I don't see anything. Okay, but dude, this I, this I take with a check. No, he should have played king h2, but then I take... Take on d2, take on c8. King h7, and okay, it's very good for me. Because I have queen f4, his king is really weak. Yeah, I want I played h5 for h4, but it was probably a chicken move. All right, <clears throat> so far, it's working reasonably. Okay, King Cru King's Crusher. Isn't there like a YouTube channel with some amazing videos, chess videos? I think it's by King Crusher, but I'm not certain. Maybe you spell it differently a bit, but there is such a YouTube channel. 
Yes. No, and, and don't worry. All my all the YouTubes that I'm watching are some pranks or some things like that. So I'm not watching too much chess on YouTube. A little bit, but not really too much. So just to make that clear. Yeah, yeah, I know Sando, but it's it's with a C, but very, very similar. But thank you. Actually, yes, I'm very... Yes, many tens of thousands of games analyzing the Immortal Blitz game that was played here on ICC by one of the coolest dudes, right, Sandro? The Immortal Bullet game. So you can go on YouTube, King Crusher, Immortal Bullet game. And Warship. Which account I played it? I think I played it under the, the Joker, right? I think I played it under the Joker account. Okay, this I take... This is not really that that exciting for black. I mean, I have perfect pawn structures. I mean, so you can't even get any play on the dark squares. Okay, this move I'm embarrassed to say I somehow overlooked. I'm embarrassed to say, but honestly saying that I overlooked this move. Oh man, what to play here? Okay. Okay, let's, whatever this crazy stuff is, let's play it. G4, my goodness. Okay, probably some stupid junk, but I don't know. Okay, I, I'm going to take, okay, this is just, it, it started as a normal game and it became completely insane. Well... I don't know. At least it's fun. But I think I'm okay. You know, I want to play Bishop E3. Okay, my pieces are... my. I have a very, very, very well-coordinated pieces, so... By the way, I could have played Queen A4 check before. It was a better move. It was a better move. But my pieces are so great, and if I need, I can put my king even on F1. If I really, really... Need or want to play something like that. Oh my gosh, I have 20 seconds. Why nobody told me? Ah! Oh. Sheesh. Blah, 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 blah. 20 seconds. Okay. That's not nice. Okay, wow. No, I completely forgot. Because I could... I, okay, I want to give a check. I want long castle. Oh, okay, and I want to play fast. That's all I want to do. Oh, I'm even going to... You know, it's it's not nice to say, right? Long, long ago, I would say 20 seconds and one second increment is eternity. But that was long ago, right, Sandro? When we get older, suddenly it's not that much. Oh, goodness. So we will have to play faster. No, wait. And we will. Okay. We are almost back. Almost okay on the clock. My opponent has a less than a minute. Okay, objectively, I think I'm completely winning here. I mean, I'm two pawns up, his king is weak, everything is defended and coordinated. I just need to do one impossible thing and remember that I don't have much time on the clock. Okay, ah! What he wants, he wants to, okay. Ah, he wants to take on c3 and that was crazy. I spent so much time to prevent him from taking on c3. Okay. Play fast, play fast, whatever you do, play fast. Okay, take. Take is good. Take is actually a horrible move. Oh my gosh, okay. I just blundered hugely here. Huh, don't know if I can save. Oh my gosh, that was one of the nastiest blunder ever. Okay, I will just get checkmated if I will not play this way. Okay, now I'm back in the game with Rook in the 7th, but... No, this was really ugly and stupid play by me. I just... No time, and I, I overlooked something. Okay, I don't want to allow his king out. 
Okay, I'm crazy. I'm playing for a win in this position. Call me crazy. Okay, I'm just pushing the pawns. Okay, now I need the king. Okay, but I have like about bazil bazillion pawns. I cannot believe that I blundered this pawn. I totally cannot believe... No. <gasps> no, I just don't see anything. It's quite embarrassing. No, this was just horrible play. Everything. Oh. No, this was just super horrible. I just don't see anything. It's actually embarrassing a bit. No, I think I will win the game, but I'm just embarrassed. Oh my gosh! No, this was the most embarrassing thing in the history. I had, I missed thousand wins here. Thousand, thousand. Oh, no. Okay, forget about it. I mean, instead of c5, rook take a5, I, I, I missed thousand wins and I've seen each one of them half a second after I played. No, 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 no. This was out of this world. Okay. Well, luckily, I'm taking it all right. No, this was... Well... Okay. Alrighty. Well, it was fun, but it, it you know, it's not, it's like... How to describe this game? It's like you get hit in your leg and it hurts so much that you're not crying, but you're kind of laughing because out of pain. That's how I feel after this game. So that's why I'm kind of cool about it. Because it's like... It's so bad that, yes, probably laughing is the best thing I can think of about this game. All right. I want to say behind us, but it will never be behind us. So let's look at this game, whatever it is. Man. No, this was just funny. Okay. I think I'm going to lose this one also. Also, one, my opponent play okay. Secondly, my head is still somewhere else. Okay. <sighs> this is funny. All right. This move I didn't think is so scary. All right, I don't know what to play. I'll play here. Okay, I don't I I couldn't have castled because of queen d3. I could have long castle, but I didn't like it with a5. I mean, I'm okay if my opponent will somehow end up winning the e5 pawn. If he will end up winning the e5 pawn, but he will really have a horrible pawn structure. No, okay, this I take with a check. Should I really be scared here? Well, maybe I should, but I'm not. I'm going to castle next move. And hopefully he will try to keep my big mouth a bit more quiet and play a bit more, so... I will not blunder every possible move, as happened before. Alrighty, but then if I keep my mouth shut, then Sandro is telling me, well, you need to talk, blah, blah, blah. Right, Sandro? So, and and, and whether, you know, it did, between the big battle of playing okay chess moves or, you know, getting in fight with the Italian Mafia, I prefer to... I prefer, uh, you know, the moves. By the way, my opponent missed knight g6, which would have won back the, the exchange. Okay, queen f6. <sighs> okay, but this I'm going to take here. By the way, again, I have 20 seconds on the clock. How this thing happened? Well, old, slow, all the above. Okay, the game is over, but I've managed to show 
with very very clear way that it's never over if you're playing me so okay I just want to exchange Queens you know let's get this thing off the board okay here and g6 all right King h7 next move I, I intend to play I should be winning here. Someone is bothering me on chat, but I cannot even, even if I want, I cannot type. I will finish the game and then tell him, yo, dude, take it easy. Okay, I want to play here. Yeah, okay, here. Obviously, I'm making it more difficult than it should have been already. No, unbelievable. Just unbelievable. No, really, actually, playing horrible today. No, okay, it happens. It happens. Once you accept that, it's okay. You know, I can really get angry or I can just say, okay, you know, today is not a day to be playing bullets. Well... I think I'm winning, but... I, I thought he should have moved the king to try and play c4, but... No right. Well, this one, this one we will win. This one we will win. Yeah, here, here, here. All right. A second is really a lot of time. You know, it sound it doesn't sound like it, but it is. Okay, this one's over. Manage almost to throw it again. Okay, ready for next. And manage to take away everyone that was annoying me okay so I thought friendly Dino okay we need to play a bit faster and blunder a bit less that's all the theory in one in one attempt okay this super boring symmetrical thingy right played by Kramnik but this I just take here, right? This is a big mistake. My, my opponent may, may be just losing here. This was Kravnik against Ananda, first game in the World Championship 2008. And, okay, many others. It's kind of known to be, I would say, equal. Just equal. But this is quite known to just be resignable. No check. Just resignable. Just resignable. Yeah, no, bishop b4 is the is the right way to go. Okay, but here, okay, I mean, it's variety of I don't even know what to choose. So, I, mean, I, I don't even care about the rook. I think I just really seriously want to go for checkmate here. This is checkmate, right? No, this Mr. Friendly Dino play bishop b4 after queen b3 and look at the game. Kramnik Anand from 2008 and many other games. Many other games were played. Were played. Um, were played this way. Okay. Park Champ. All right. Took me a second to try and analyze this name. Park Champ. I guess he's the champion of some park. Cemetery Park, right now. But he's not playing Mr. Park Champ. No moves.
Okay, IWTGB. I wish to understand what is this name. I want the Great Britain. I want the Great Britain. Okay. What else can it be? I wish to get burger. That's actually not bad. I wish to get burger. Okay. I wish you play a move. How about we... Oh, a move. Okay, I'll play also a move. And now Sandro will get both of us burgers. I wish... Now, now the entire game, I know my stupid brain. I'm going to try and think about what initials IWTGB makes. Okay. I have some, but they don't should not be mentioned loudly here, so I'm not going to mention them. Okay, but... Okay, let's say with I wish to get burger. All right, I wish to protect the pawn. <coughs> All right. All right. Okay, so uh, it's always whether white can prove that he... There are two ways when allowing black to capture on c4. Whether whether black can prove... That, sorry, white, that he has enough counterplay or whether he can attack the pawns immediately. I don't think... I don't see where my opponent is getting any of those in this position. And black has really one idea. Okay, not get checkmated, develop, let's put it on one idea, and then get to play c5 at one moment. So, uh, if I get to play c5, I think by all standards, uh, black is actually not just going to be a pawn up. Alright. Sandals making jokes there. Okay, I'll castle and I will go knight d5. On the next move, knight d5 and then c5. Yeah, I could have played c5 before. All right, I'll go c5 here. So, I mean, we can quite say that white opening play has yielded him nothing but worse position and and the pawn down. That's not really that great. Okay, I will take. And, okay, I'll, I'll take here first. I mean, I'm not certain, actually, if that was, from the structural point of view, that correct of me to play this way, but, well, we did. Could, I should have taken just immediately on c5. I, I, I prefer white pawn to be on b2 than on c3. It's better for me, for black, if white pawn is on b2. Okay, now... Let's go here and queen d3 pre move. It kind of just play itself, right? I mean, if he takes, I'm actually not certain how to take. I know I should say I, wa I want to take with the knight, of course, but taking with the pawn can be tempting in some situations, you know? Because I really like my knight on. I actually think I'm going to take with the. Well. I would have taken with the pawn. Actually, interesting. I will check after the game what Mr. Computer is thinking. But somehow I like take with the with the uh, pawn. Okay, this I'm gonna take. Alrighty. This seems promising. Rook d8. Okay, I just want to go f6 e5. f6 e5 is going to be awesome if I can get to play that. Then I'm controlling d4, killing his bishop. The game is over. Okay, not intending to blunder the queen, but intending next move to go f6 e5. All right, I said it. I'm a man of my word sometimes. So, white is totally shut. Okay, let's get rid of the queens. And let's trap the queen. If you don't want to exchange, I want to win it. Okay, IWTGB, 
TGB. Opening. If you allow the CFO pawn. Okay, Park Champ. In a comeback. Okay, let's play the London system. I haven't played this junk quite some time. Super duper junk, so. No, oh, wait. All right. Now we're lo Take. Okay. So, kind of, kind of similar story to before from the structure point of view, right? Um, okay, I'm trying to think if I have some smart. B I could have tied bishop take f7, but all right, we will leave it for next time. Okay, with the knight on d2, not on c3, maybe I can claim. Maybe I can claim to. To have done something, I'm not actually even certain what, but all right, let me go here. Probably nothing. I just have nothing in this position. Nah, I'll try to play on the structure a bit, but I black is totally okay. Yeah, I didn't want to allow him c5, and okay, well, we'll see what this we'll see what this position brings us if I will be in time to. Put something on c5. I can think about being better, but I'm not in time to do anything. Yeah. Okay. So I will try to play a bit there. I don't know. Maybe it's going to overlook my big, big threat. Yeah, it's interesting. I mean, I think black should try and make effort to play b4, a5, bishop, a6. The move rook c8, no, okay, of course, or a legal move, but I think he has to activate the bishop. Okay, this is a fair enough move. To be honest, I wasn't thinking so much about this move. I thought more about g6, but the move my opponent played is better than what I was thinking. No big surprise, but I still mention it. It's better than what I was thinking. So I want to go bishop g5 next move. I can th think about h4 bishop g5, but this is the direction that I'm playing already. I'm playing on this side of the board. Yeah. Okay, it's interesting. I think he has one... Okay, this move, I guess he wants to play f6. Okay, I guess he wants to play... I, I'm not certain. I thought this move was... Actually, I'm not certain why I played the move I did, and I'm not certain why he played the move he did. Everything is big mystery for me, for him, for both. Okay, I, I will try to play that way. No, okay, no, but this this is bad play from my opponent. This is no, no, this is a s beyond a dream for White. Okay, I, I need to play well, of course, but this is the the knight on c5 was my fantasy of fantasies, and my opponent just ended it to me, you know, in like in such a such a nice way. Okay, I mean, maybe he really likes me. No. Objective? Okay. My opponent is totally lost here. Objectively. Whether I'm going to win the game or not. Alright. That's another big story. This feels like a blunder, no? But I can't see why. Okay. It's for certain a blunder. I just couldn't see or understand why. So I'm playing super... It for certain was a blunder. Maybe I'm wrong, but I couldn't see why. <coughs> Okay. Yeah. I kind of allowed him to... I don't know. No time, no this, no that. I thought I had some... Well, I, I had decisive advantage. It's not about I thought. I know that I was winning, but okay. Somehow today, time is actually really, really being a factor with my 
super duper slow play. Today it's really a factor. Yeah, I don't understand how my opponent is is opening files and lines in this position. This is a mystery to me. Okay, of course, I bl blundered insanely, but still totally winning here. Okay, this is his rook. Yeah, I mean, okay, uh, I was winning just a few seconds on the clock, and but exchanging the dark color bishop gave me the c5 square and once I got the c5 square okay technically it was over just my horrible technique couldn't deliver anything okay I have pre-moved d5 on anything you see I'm I did Okay, I'm gonna take and now f3, right? I really like it when they go crazy to attack it like that. Okay, I'll just try to play the usual stuff e6, e6, this, that. Try to prove that this is nothing but junk variation for white. I think they played with bishop c4, h3, and stuff like that, but I don't know. Okay, I'm just taking everything. That is my big strategy. Okay, I develop. Okay, so where is white compensation? You know, I'm saying it because many people like to give a pawn for what seems to be slightest threat. Not serious chess, right? I mean, that's not how we want to how we want to play our normal chess. Okay, I don't know what to play here. I'll play castle. At some point I want to go c5 and so on. Could have played c5 before that. Okay, I mean, what is he going to play? Knight g3, queen e1, the usual stuff, but I, I think it's not nothing close to be enough for white here. Okay, let, let, let's exchange everything. How about that? I'm okay exchanging everything. Being a pawn up. Okay, you can play... Actually, you cannot even play knight h5. Right, I don't... Yeah, okay. How should I take? I'm going to take like this. But maybe it was better to take the other way, actually. I don't know. Okay, so, you know, remember that tiny pawn that was supposed to give white some pressure? This is the pawn that white is missing here. Put the pawn on f2, it's a draw, no pawn, no draw. If rook e1, I don't think I will, <laughs> I don't think I will exchange. I mean, I think it's probably good enough, but I don't want to change this structure, you know, the balance. I'm easy pawn up. But take, take, and rookie 7, rookie 8 was winning. That was easily winning. Actually, it was better to take, but I don't know. My motto today is not to play the, ble the best moves, and proudly I'm uh, doing an amazing job. <clears throat> okay, now white queen is really, really, really out of play. Actually, I think white is resigning here. White is resigning. If you are looking at it, maybe you can try to figure why I just say this is game over. Okay. Out. The queen is out. No pieces. So I have this check. And this one. No pieces. This is checkmate in few moves. Okay. I don't know. H3 is... H3, H4 only moves, but we are not going to analyze that, right? Yeah. Yeah. Queen got stuck on b3 and so on, but it was a bit, a bit, I, I will tell you again, be very cheap about the material that you are giving. Be very cheap about the material that you are giving. That's all I'm going to say. 
All right. Oh my gosh, Sabretude. Okay, I'm not even trying to figure out this name. Poof. Okay, Sabretooth. Tio Gal. No idea. Dude, that's one of the greatest name ever. You got it. Okay, and suddenly, you know, I haven't mentioned food too much. I'm thinking about the amazing apple cake. Apple pie, you know, call it the amazing apple pie here. Why can't I move? Um, too complicated name. I don't know why you cannot move. I mean, I played my move. Sandro, allow the man to move. Maybe you made Sandro angry at some point. Maybe you made Sandro angry at some point. Uh, okay, we will play again. I'm certain if you will ask again, we will play Nezhmadinov. One of the greatest geniuses <coughs> to have played chess. He wasn't, he was just an international master, but a very, very strong one. He beat Tal in amazing game. He beat several other great players. And what was he? He was one of the world, if not the world best backgammon player and huge genius about many things. Okay, I'll just take and play here. I, I will try to go for my space. My space, oh man. Oh, that doesn't sound that amazing, but I'll try to play a bit for space. Yeah, I think I'm a bit better here, but actually not so much, you know. I... Not so much. I, I I didn't play it very well. I'm a bit... Yeah, I thought 9g6 was a bit more accurate. Okay, I, I... Maybe I'm still a bit better. Yeah, just the structure and... It's a bit favoring... A bit favoring um, white. But not much. I, I thought I would have more, actually, when... When he played it in the opening, tiny weird, but all right. In the great spirit of Nez Nezmedinov, I'm not going to allow you to to take on d5. Okay, I will play this move. Very good for the structure and also taking away all crazy ideas such as knight h4. If black might have had her. Yeah, I okay. I think black should go for one plan here, but I do not intend to tell it to my opponent. I want to play, and after I will say what I think he should play. Uh, I don't think this way. I thought black had to go to, to play and play c6. I thought c6 was essential idea for my opponent. And after it b taken, okay, black is kind of okay there. Nothing, nothing to discuss much. But now, now, I don't think so. I don't think you can play this move. Okay, I can take pretty much anything, everything, everywhere, anywhere, I don't know. Knight f5, knight here, knight there. Okay, I'm just going to take here like a big chicken. No, this, Mr. Opponent, you gave me everything. The c7 pawn, okay. If someone again will decide to be serious and go over this game. The c7 pawn is pretty much white's only target. And that's what white should have been, should have been targeting. Okay, can I win a piece like this? I think I can. 
Also, Queen take d6 was winning material. No, okay. It's a decent moment to resign. Okay, unless you really want to play on time. Which, okay, I cannot tell you, I cannot tell you not to do. Okay, then giving me another rook is a lot. That is a lot of material. Okay, we will exchange the pair of rooks. No, okay, that's a lot of time. That is a lot of time, and we shall win this one. Knight c6 pre-move, I don't care whatever he plays. Excuse me. And rook d8 checkmate. All right. Now let's see. Cyber 3, 2, Stai, uh, guys. Oof. Most complicated, seriously, probably most complicated username ever. For example, I see there is a username books are nice okay we can discuss whether books are nice or not considering that i waited a few years not to complete reading lord of the rings just when it went to the movie theater i stopped reading and then i waited two years to complete the series i think it was two well more than two years but books are nice okay the pieces are stuck again so how about you really try and do what Sandro is saying, you know, disconnect and I don't know what else, you know, that's Sandro's job. If I will get into Sandro's territory, he will, you know, Sandro and the dictator, you know, they are like with the same movement, so not getting there. Someone left me a message. Let's see a message. Exciting. Oh, someone wrote something about what it maybe means that... Maybe, I don't know. I, I said maybe it's something like that. That can be interesting. Okay, I will concentrate on my game with the one minute I have. It's too cold. You know, I, f I freeze my room. I totally freeze my room. Then it gets too hot, but... Okay, so pretty much very similar stuff to what we've seen before. I think the move a5, a3 are somewhat helping white. I, I agree with that. They are somewhat little bit helping white. Okay, this... Okay, we can discuss whether yes, whether no. I still I still think black is very okay here. Okay, not not giving you the h6 pawn. I think white is fighting for uh, white is fighting to get enough space here. I don't think black should complain much about that. We like space, we like all those things. So what do I want to play? I want to play bishop out at some point. Okay, yeah, you can play this move, but I'm not going to allow you to play b4 at a comfortable moment for you. So, by all standards, I mean, this... Right? I mean, black is, I think, better here. And if not, then at least I... Yeah... Yeah, yeah, yeah. Yeah, I, could, I should have maybe played d4 before bishop e6. There was some some nuance in playing that way, but no, right, I didn't. I didn't. But I still think white pieces are kind of kind of seem stuck, if you ask me here. But maybe it's not that clear. All right, my opponent in a very 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 deep thinking here. Resign. I think he overlooked rook takes b3, d4, knight c4. I think he overlooked that he has knight c4. And I was thinking that when he started to think that that's what he's missing. 
Okay, I have to play with at some point with book or, books or nice after I. All right, why to play? Man, I got tired. I couldn't believe that I get get tired playing for you blitz games. But okay, playing, talking, blundering—that's what I've been doing mostly. Okay, I had some some games that were decent. That game was I, I really liked it when Sandro. When Sandro was, uh, I think he wrote laugh, LOL on the channel when I took my head down. Man, because, yeah, that was like, that was the best moment of, you know. Because it was the most authentic thing in the world that I could have done and felt. Like, so, okay, my opponents don't, don't want to play. Okay, let's see if we can move the pieces. Oh, okay, we can. Then you need to do me one favor. Explain after, after the game, if you can hear me. Explain wh what that handle means. Okay, English. Blah, 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 blah. English, symmetrical English. Okay, I, I play... Uh, I play this chicken line. I think Anderson used to play some games. It should be okay for black, of course, but well, there's a few tricky ideas, you know, if white get 95 and all the diagonals are open and so on, white can pretend to be better there. For example, let's just say, I don't know, bishop f5, 95, I think is just in white's favor. I think so. Okay. Also, this I, I this is my idea. I think I think I gain control of the long diagonal really fast, and I think it should mean something, but maybe not. Okay, ready to ready to go to sleep. But before that, I want the apple pie. Okay, but look, uh, my opponent had, I think had to play like knight d4 or something because this position is just just very very pleasant for white. By all standards you want. This is just super pleasant for white. Okay, I'm going to take. And now I don't know. I'll play queen d2. I want rook d1. I want queen e3. I mean, the bishop on g2 is white's big, big hero. It is white's big, big hero in this position. Okay, I, I would really, really think that black is much much worse here yes but man no the d5 square the d6 square I mean end game is lost here I think or very very bad a6 created more weaknesses on b6 okay maybe maybe I'm too extreme but I don't think so I don't think so okay I'm gonna go here I'm gonna go here Maybe 94 or something, but... Okay, this... Black just created one weakness after the other. I, th I think, like, really, really way too many. And if you look at this position, I mean, okay, it's just lost. I mean, Black is just lost here, and... No, th this, this take on e5 is tiny tricky. But okay, of course my opponent should not self-destruct that way. Okay, it's just white is winning material here, I think, right? Everything is coordinated and black is full of weaknesses. Yeah, this this Mr. Opening, this you should, you can look a little bit at the opening. I think after bishop f4, what is a normal move they play? I think queen b6 is a legal move or some stuff like that, but a few other ways there to play. Okay, this is... Yeah, but this is, you know, you think this is aggressive move. I think this is a move that creates even more weaknesses. Now the e6 square. I mentioned the e6 square, I wasn't joking. So that's, that's about it for this one. Yeah, you know... Pushing, 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 pushing. Okay, great. 
give me the d6 square, the e6 square, the c6 square, give me all those squares. All those squares. All right. Books are nice. Okay. Books are nice. Sandro, how many games do we have left? I have no idea. I think one or two or three or something like that, but probably one or two, but I, you're the big boss. You are the big boss. All right. Okay, I... I played a blitz game against Kaspar of thousand years ago that played d4. And I was totally winning, it was a draw. Just because I was chickening out because it was that annoying dude. But I, uh, I there's a line that sacrifices the pawn, I took it and actually this line, yeah, this line is interesting one, it's... It, it's okay for black, but there are some ideas for white also to play that. I mean, structure-wise, it's like I have, I have a French, I have a French without the bishop, so that that cannot be bad, right? It's like a French without, without the bishop. Okay, this, this. Okay. Yeah, they play. They, there is such an idea. Actually, I, I I haven't looked at that. There is one one bit annoying idea here that White is playing in this position. I lost actually a bullet game to Caruana in this line on ICC. It was so funny. I was I got checkmated in just winning and got checkmated on move twenty. It was so funny. I thought Queen take G seven when I won the d4 pawn. It was exactly this line. It was uh, maybe a bit annoying. Okay, I don't know. I could have played f6 maybe or something, but I think this is just a normal way to play. At some point maybe transfer the bishop and so on. Okay. Yeah, I want to transfer the bishop this way. But okay, the opponent has okay. There's there are some uh, tricky ideas here. I mean, exchanging both rooks for certain is going to be healthy for black. I'm not certain. Okay, here I let's say I go here. And okay, now now I feel I'm just now I feel I'm okay. So sorry, I'm better because I I will I. One idea that is really annoying for white is rook e3, rook d3, and then the rook is going to the third, to the third rank. I mean, I don't think that the search on ICC is working yet, but if not, it was possible to see a game I played with one of my handles against Mr. Adaptation. That was a very, at least theoretical one in this line. Okay. So my opponent is burning a lot of time, which is good. Okay, I'm going to take. You know, okay, and play this move. I Maybe could have had this intermediate knight g5. Oh my gosh. Maybe. Because now, of course, I'm going to play h6. So if he's going to play queen d3 or something, h6. Now I also want to exchange. Okay, we can exchange this one. Here. Okay, I mean, I'm not saying it's something gigantimo, but okay, I'm happy to play this one. Okay, honestly, it's probably nothing, but it's better to be, it's better to be, um, maybe better to be black in this nothing. This move, I'm not certain, but okay, I had this idea. I, I don't think I'm better here anymore, but I, I just really like this idea that I can now go and target go and target the A3 pawn. It's probably stupid way how I played, but well, that's how I played. Okay. 
so technically I should be okay I actually think I no maybe I achieved way way more than I should have by the way no okay I'm just winning now just easily winning actually my opponent should have played better but that was kind of my idea you know I, I always said uh, it's somewhat better for black how, how much better is is another story now I have all the time in the world so okay I'll play here and here well maybe maybe I didn't play that amazing I don't know Okay. Oh man, I thought that. Okay, I have no idea what I'm doing anymore, so just letting you know. Okay, somehow it's working. <laughs> okay, somehow it's working. I don't even know what I'm doing here. Okay, sorry, I need to go back. I think it's working. I have no idea, you know. I think I was fooling around too much in this position. Okay. Okay, now it feels healthy. Yeah. Okay, I'm kind of tiny bit quiet because I'm pretending to think, but all right. You know, it's like you cannot even attack one pawn. Uh, so. I mean, it was interesting, but the end game started tiny, 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 tiny better for Black. I feel, you know, when allowing him to take on C4 or not, I don't know if it was right, but okay. I think this is the last one, so no wait. We have to. Okay, overall, okay, it was kind of fun. Man, the game I lost was. No, it was great. Well, but let's not do it much more often, right? It was great to do it once in forever. Okay, so we are kind of playing the kind of playing some sort of um, stone wall. But I got my bishop out. It's a bit different version. No pawn on g3 and all those things. So, I mean. I don't know. I think I, I like white in this story here. I think I like white a bit here because... Okay, I actually don't know why. But I think I do. All right. I mean... White's better here, right? So I, I have one plan, but one plan is not is not bad. I'm going to play c5, b4, a4, and so and so and so on. And I can actually consider taking on taking on d5 before that, but I don't know. Yeah. Okay, now I'm almost certain I'm going to take, you know. Now I'm almost certain I will take and I'll play this move. I don't know, kind of like it there, but maybe I wasn't right. Maybe I wasn't right. Yeah, and my opponent gets some counterplay, silly counterplay that he should not get, but still this has to be better, just has to be better. Okay, take. It just... Okay, but I don't know if I can win it. Better is beautiful, but... I don't think I played well at some point here. And I think for certain I have 30 somewhat seconds, so... Ha! Huh. Yeah, actually, those positions... Why it's better, but... Wasn't really easy to put the finger on. Okay, where where should I really have played much better? I I think I could at some points, but I'm not certain. Well, okay, something to 
to look and analyze a bit after. Okay, now, okay, this I want to play against f5. Okay, this you gave me no take back. This no take back. I think it should be in my favor to get this, but yeah, this this is not okay. And if I take okay, so if I take again queen f7 and some some stuff, some 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 stuff. Okay, I'll go here. Yeah. No, this this is a big this is delicate position. Like I'm not hundred percent certain exactly what and where I should go, but as long as this bishop is out of play like it's now, I feel comfortable that Okay, I, I actually you're not gonna believe me. I've seen this move and I thought that after take he has to take with he has to take with uh, oh my gosh, this is crazy. That he has to take with uh, with the pawn. I just thought that he has to play queen takes f4. No, just that was crazy. That that was why why I blundered. I just thought that he has to play that. Yeah, okay. Well, this was silly game. Okay, good job, good job. All right. Next time. This game actually made me a bit angry. Because it was just... The, the other one was just funny. This one was just stupid. There's a difference between losing funny and losing stupid. This one was losing stupid. Anyhow. I'll see you next week. Next week. Next month. Alright. Hope you had fun. Mainly on my expense. Bye. -bye.